Uh, right. uh, my name is Lloyd Reynolds. Uh, I came second at UK Strongest Man last year. Uh, I'm six foot two, and I fit a four XL shirt. Uh, well, I train as a physio, and I work for a local NHS hospital. But uh, my true passion is in strongman. Big, uh, tall, but not as tall as I'm finding out. Uh, trousers on the whole, just generally, because I find I've got a small waist and my thighs are quite big. So on the whole, I tend to find clothes are quite tight fits around my legs. I got into my career about four years ago, um, just for a friend who started tra I trained with, and then all of a sudden he he moved on, and then I kept going. Uh, and yeah, definitely size is a big ass, especially when it comes to stuff like truck pulling and pulling the cars. You need a lot of weight behind you to help pull it. Mondays I'll start off by doing squats and legs and then Wednesdays it's kind of looking at upper body stuff so a lot of shoulder pressing, bench press and stuff like that and then Thursday it's sort of deadlifts and upper back sessions so and Saturdays it's just event stuff so practice things like log, things like the yoke, things like flipping the tyre and stones and stuff like that. Clothes style, so I'm generally more relaxed so I tend to go with trackies and t-shirt most of the time it's just I'm generally quite a relaxed person by nature so. Um, yeah, it's sort of, it's, it's so so. You tend to find some of the smaller guys uh, benefit at some of the events, and some of the bigger guys do better at some of the other events. Things like squatting is really more fitted towards a shorter bloke, and things like lifting stones up onto a platform fits a bigger bloke just because they're already at that height, so it makes things a bit easier. But it's six to one and half a dozen of the other. There's no real. It's what's nice about the sport, your size doesn't really make too much of a difference, but definitely we're finding as the sport's progressing in strongman, definitely the bigger you are, the, the better you're going to be. You're always guaranteed an upgrade on a flight is one, because um, <laughs> no one wants to sit next to you. And there's not, to be honest, you, you tend to have to squeeze into a lot of things, so there's not really too many benefits, people just tend to get out of your way, it's quite nice. <laughs>